Big Wednesday delivered in a massive way on the very last day of the six-day contest period for the GKA Wave and Strapless Freestyle Tour Finals. A fitting climax to what has been a very successful first Grand Slam Tour season. The result couldn't have been tighter in the end. Machu Lopez became tour leader after his win in Mauritius at the last round and commanded a 300-point lead coming into this event. If Ayrton won this event, Machu needed to finish no more than four places behind him to become champion. But nothing's easy in this field. He drew Kiyohi the avoiders in the quarters, and the tension was nervy on the beach. If Machu made it to the semis, the championship would have been his. He lost. The announcement came with Ayrton already on the water entering his semi-final, who went on to trade blows with teammate and Marcus Riveros, and prevailed. Kiyohi had to deal with Portuguese powerhouse Paulina Pereira. The waves stuttered a little in that second semi, but Kiyohi picked the pearls and smashed out one more win. The final was of epic proportions. Ayrton went at it with everything, perhaps a little too much, and lost his board uncharacteristically on a couple of occasions. Meanwhile, Kiahi kept his cool and his wave count high, and eventually, once back on the beach, had victory confirmed, meaning that he maintained an undefeated record in Morocco on four occasions. And by winning, he also cancelled out having too much of an influence over the championship result by beating both Machu and Ayrton today. Machu walks away with the first GKA Wave and Strapless Freestyle Rider of the Year trophy, winning by the narrowest of margins over his best friend and rival, Ayrton. Not a bad day at the office. Full action wrap coming soon.